Hey you guys, it's Rachel here with Sensei Tempo Kenny Corso, and I wanted to show you guys how I tape my puppy's ears. Um, um, so I'm going to tape Liberty's ears. Um, I'll show you guys. What are you doing? So, if you can see here, preacher, please go away. Now, go away. Mess with my tape. Go now. I swear to you. Ah, no, they know when I. I said no. No, 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 no. And you know. Okay. All right. So. You can see here, this ear is curved here. This ear didn't get, the stitches um, were not in this top part of the ear. And what it can end up happening is that, <clears throat> is that the ear heals crooked like this, or not crooked, but curved like this. And it can actually prevent the ear from standing. It'll kind of maintain that curvature. So what I like to do to, to, to keep that from happening is I like to take the ear and kind of roll it out, right? I'm like, gonna go over there. So, I got a couple packages today, so. Right, yeah, we did. So, I just like to take it and just kind of roll it out like that, right? So kind of flip it out, boop, kind of push that out like that, roll it out like so, and then fasten it. So, sit down, good girl. <laughs> You guys, stop. Cashmere, there's no one there. Quit. All right, so let's do this. Cashmere. At midnight. Oh, we're going to be right there so you guys can see that. All right, so we'll try to do it quick. So we're going to push it out like that. Push it out. I know, Shivers. I know. Roll it out. I know. <laughs> it's not exactly the most... Uh... Yeah, normally I have help doing this. So... Um, alright, so let's see, right there. Hey, you two, quit that. Push it out. It doesn't have to be perfect. What's so weird? <clears throat> and I take it, I put it in here, and I roll. I know! I know! I roll backwards. Oh, she's so upset. Uh, oh, shoot. No, oh, she rolled that. This is not working. Alright, sit. <clears throat> Got some, uh, I know, I see you. I know. I know. I know. She's got some crap in her ear from the stitches or whatever. Yep. It's the it's like it was literally like a piece of nasty glue. Alright, so we're gonna take it, roll it back, like so, push it out. Cashmere, stop. Not in the mood. Oh so get down. And the tape keeps coming undone. Sometimes you just have to put it on. Like it doesn't matter if the tape is perfect or not. As long as it's standing up that ear. As long as it's on there, just let it be on there. You don't want it to be like super tight, but you also don't want it just coming off either. So that really didn't. And you also want to make sure they don't want to itch it off or anything. That didn't quite. I guess it'll work for now, but I'm gonna try to curve, curve it up. <clears throat> so that's definitely better than, than it was. Put her head down a little bit there. But ultimately, it could be, you yeah. <clears throat> know. Every piece of tape I grab is it's getting folded. Is getting folded. <clears throat> I know. Oh, All right, so that's actually yeah, that not bad. that looks good. Yeah, that's not bad. That's it. Now. It's coming up, huh? Yeah. Down ideally. Down, it's just sanding it up. Yeah, ideally, I would do better than that, but normally I would actually have another set of hands on it. So same thing with this one. You want to take that one up too? You're going to turn it. You're going to. 
push it out with your thumb. Hold on, let me get push that. it out, roll it back. So try to tuck that in there. And you're not I should have I honestly should have cleaned her ears first because she has this nasty um, glue residue. Do we have paper towels out? Yeah, we do. Okay. From the vet's office. <clears throat> hey, also. Also. Yeah. All right. It's actually preventing me from doing a good job. <clears throat> she actually does a lot better than most of the dogs. Usually they're squirming. They're like, oh, yeah. Nasty. He uses this like rubber cement. We have some right now, yeah. To keep it in. I see you. You're a good girl. She loves you. You're so. a good girl. She... Okay, so here's my. Is she wagging her tail? Yes, we have our dog up on the counter. <laughs> oh, she has big legs, so she has. So hold her tight. Oh gosh, hello. My my, she is. Off. Just take it and no, I said no, no. I got to another girl. No, no, no. She is a crazy little lady. Crazy lady. No. Velocity, go lay down. Go play. Go okay. over there with your mom. Go with your mom. Come here, sugars. So turn her around. Sit she's been she's been real good. Take our piece of tape. We're gonna push it out with our thumb and then curve it back, which is not really because that it's gonna I know I see you. Yeah, it's gonna wanna She's like <laughs> I know, I see you. I know. Oh, I would remove her real quick. She's not looking that easy. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know. I'll get that later. Yeah, she's fixing to knock everything over. Hold on. House full of dogs. All right, so preferably you'll do this with somebody holding on to the dog because that's genuinely limiting my ability to do this correctly. Um, but I only have Savannah to help out with. And I'm videoing. And she's videoing. Okay. I know, I see you. I know, there we go, there we go, there we go. That's better. Thank Jesus, she was still. I know, right? Just for a second. Okay, so you really don't want it to be super tight or anything like that because you'll cut off the circulation to the ears. But what I will say is on an ear like this, um, I am the kind of person that will do like a tighter, a tighter binding than you should for one day if it's to the point where the ear has already started to, to actually like heal in that way. Um, we already took out our stitches. And then what I'll do is I'll also, I'll do the tape and then I'll give it a forming afterwards to try to make sure that it maintains. So if you can see here, do you see how it's standing up more? Mm -hmm. Right? So better than this one actually. That but this one actually wasn't so bad. and. Truth be told, this is not the right tape. You actually want to use a tape called Elasticon. Okay, let me go back. Um, you can only get it on Amazon from what I've seen. Um, She's so yeah, you know, cute. You can only get it on Amazon from what I've seen. But um, it's the best tape. I know, I know, so good. She know. loves mom a lot. You know, gotta tape your ears. So anyway, so sorry, the uh, camera cut off, but I just wanted to show you guys what's going on here with her. Um, this ear is ideal. This ear is not. This is loose, but this one really didn't matter as much because it wasn't as bad. Um, so I will most likely redo this one tomorrow just because it is a little bit tighter than it should be. 
but that's because I want to um, kind of stretch this ear, the base of the ear out a little bit so that the ear will stand and not want to flop itself over. So sometimes you have to do it a little, not a lot, a little bit tighter than you would normally need to in order to get it to kind of, you know, stretch a little bit and reform. But, um, but she should be fine. So that's all you need. So I hope that helps. Um, I, if it wasn't this tight and I had just done a, like, like this one, like a typical, um, taping, I would leave them on for three days, take it off for a day, let them breathe and then retape them up the third, uh, for three more days until they stand on their own. Now if they don't have to stand perfectly up perfectly. They just need to be mostly standing. You don't want it flopped over like this or flopped over on the top of the head. Ultimately, even a good crop um, can need a little bit of taping. And also sometimes the ear, when they're teething, will get, will kind of like, uh, like not go over the head, but it'll just kind of get a little floppy. And that's not always necessary to tape. So you just have to kind of play it by ear, <laughs> ear, get it. And, um, and see, uh, what is working and if you, you know, if it's going to stand, if you, if you have a question and you're not sure if you should tape it or not, send me a picture, um, via email and I'll give you an idea as to whether or not you're going to need to tape that ear or not. But this will be a process. Um, hers may stand after this. I doubt it, but, um, this one probably will, but this one may not just because the way it was, because it wasn't, it didn't stand the whole time because the stitches didn't go all the way up and the stitches are what actually give it some structure. But, um, but anyway, it will stand. It's not a problem. It's just, it may take a couple more tapings than just the one. So I figured I would show you guys at least the start of it and let you see how that's going. Oh, no, no, no. So anyway, hope you guys are having a good day. Say goodbye, Liberty. Say goodnight, Liberty. Say goodnight, Liberty. Anyway, I'll talk to y'all later. Bye!